Welcome to CSE Guru. In this session, we will discuss the next problem under decrease in convoy technique that is graph traversal. So, already we have discussed insertion shot under decrease in convoy technique. The next important problem we will discuss under decrease in convoy technique is graph traversal. So, here graph traversal means visiting nodes of a graph one after the another in a systematic manner that is start from one arbitrary vertex consider that as a starting vertex and visit that vertex from this vertex visit all other vertices in the given graph one by one we have to visit okay visit all other vertices one by one in the given graph in a systematic manner that is nothing but graph traversal so, graph traversal is a systematic method of exploring every vertex. Either we will tell it as vertex or node or point. So, this is nothing but vertex or node or point. So, systematic method of exploring every vertex or node or point in a graph data structure is nothing but graph traversal. So, there are two important techniques under graph traversal. One is breadth first search. And another one is depth first search. So, breadth first search means it starts by visiting an arbitrary vertex, then visits all vertices with the distance from the starting vertexes 1. Okay. So, first level it will start from arbitrary vertex or starting vertex and mark that vertex as visited. That is, initially starting vertex you can mark it as visited. From that vertex, visit all the vertices from the distance with the starting vertex 1. Mark it as visitor. Okay. So, the first level nodes from the starting vertex visit all the nodes and mark it as visitor. Then visit all vertices with the distance from the starting vertex 2. That is second level vertices from the starting vertex and mark all the vertices as visitor. Then third level vertices, then fourth level vertices. Likewise, level wise you are going to visit the vertices one by one. That is nothing but the breadth first search. And the depth first search if you are considering in the sense, it starts by visiting an arbitrary vertex that is called starting vertex and initially mark the starting vertex as visitor and then search and visit vertices in the graph deeply as possible. So, from the starting vertex, consider the unvisited vertex connected to the starting vertex. Okay. So, if there are more than one vertices in the sense, the tie we will break it by using alphabetical order. The nodes you have to visit in alphabetical order or in the number order. If they have given the vertices as numbers. Okay. If there is a tie, break the tie by considering the alphabetical order. So, consider one vertex in alphabetical order and visit that vertex from the starting vertex. It should be connected to the starting vertex. So, from the starting vertex, consider the next level vertex, one vertex and visit that vertex. From that vertex, consider its next level vertex and visit that vertex. And then, Consider that vertex, currently visited vertex. From that vertex, which are all the vertices connected, select one vertex in arbitrary order. Okay, that is in alphabetical order and visit that vertex. Likewise, the algorithm proceeds. So, here if you are considering from the starting vertex, next level consider only one vertex. And from that vertex, that is currently visited vertex, next level consider only one vertex. And from that currently visited vertex, Next level consider one vertex and visit that. So, likewise the procedure continues. Suppose if in the deeper all the nodes are visited in the sense come back to the previous node and consider the next adjacent vertices which is unvisited and visit that vertex. Likewise the algorithm proceeds. So, the depth first search if we are considering in the sense it starts by visiting the arbitrary vertex and then it searches and visits the vertices in the given graph as deeply as possible. So, if you are considering in the sense the depth first search will proceed to visit the vertices like this top to bottom. Breadth first search if you are considering in the sense it will proceed to visit the vertices like this. Okay. So, first level, second level, third level. Likewise, breadth wise it will visit. Depth first search, depth wise it will visit. Suppose this depth is over in the sense, come back and visit the next depth. 
in this level all the nodes should be visited and then it will go to the next step so likewise the procedure continues so breadth wise search in the sense breadth wise it will visit the vertices so this is the main difference and here in breadth wise search we will implement the data structure to solve the problem that is q data structure and in depth wise search we will use stack data structure okay so this is the main difference to implement breadth wise search and depth wise search for example in this graph if we are considering what is the order of vertices we will visit up using breadth wise search in the sense consider a as the arbitrary vertex or the starting vertex okay and visit vertex a first so starting vertex we are going to visit in breadth wise search as a next up breadth wise it will consider so this will be considered as level 0 and the next level is this one d and b is the next level so d and b if you are considering in this one, so both are in level 1 which one you will visit first so here we will break the tie using the alphabetical order so b will be visited first and then the alphabetical order d will be visited so if you are considering from the starting vertex a the vertices connected to a all the vertices should be visited in alphabetical order or arbitrary order okay so b will be visited first d will be visited so what are all the vertices connected to a we have visited now b and d next come to vertex b so from b what are all the vertices connected a and c is connected right so a is already visited you need to consider the next unvisited vertex from b that is nothing but c okay and then so now all the vertices connected to b is visited that is a is visited c is visited next consider vertex d and from this vertex consider the unvisited vertices connected to d so a and c a is already visited c is already visited so the vertices connected to d all vertices are visited so this is also over next to consider c and if you are considering c the vertices connected to c are b and d that is already visited so now this complete graph is visited so now this complete graph all the vertices we have visited by using breadth first search so this is the result of breadth first search for this given graph in depth first search if you are considering in the sense consider one vertex as the starting vertex or arbitrary vertex that here we will consider it as a so first we will visit a next consider the vertices connected to a that is b and d right so from b and d which will be visited first in alphabetical order so b will be visited first so next you visit b now from b which are all the vertices connected a and c a is already visited c is unvisited so now we will visit c next from c which are all the unvisited vertices consider those vertices so from c d is unvisited visit d from d a is connected but a is already visited so now this depth is over a b c d again it is coming back to a only it is not it is already visited okay next what do you do it in the sense from vertex a the depth all the nodes we have visited next consider vertex b so from vertex b if any other unvisited vertices is there in the sense visit those vertices suppose if any other vertex is there here in the sense visit those vertex so the depth of b should be visited next all the nodes depth wise we need to consider and visit all other vertices next come to c depth wise you need to consider all other vertices next d likewise you need to complete the algorithm okay so this is nothing but depth first search so breadth first search a b d c this is the order we will visit the vertices and in depth first search a b c d this is the order we will visit the vertices okay for example consider this graph what is the bfs order of visiting the vertices and dfs order of visiting the vertices so breadth first search if you are considering this is breadth wise so it will visit one first next to 2 3 4 next 5 6 7 c the procedure is first it will visit starting vertex 1 from this vertex it will visit the next level vertices 2 3 and 4 next it will consider the vertex 2 so from the vertex 2 what are all the next level vertices that is 5 and 6 it will be visited next next consider vertex 3 from this vertex what are all the next level unvisited vertices no vertex okay so go to 4 so from 4 what are all the next level unvisited vertices 7 and 8 
now this is over next go to 5 next level unvisited vertices from 5 is 9 and 10 next go to 6 no vertices next go to 7 next level unvisited vertices is 11 and 12 and go to 8 no vertex from 8 9 10 11 12 there is no other vertices okay so this is the order of visiting the vertex in bfs breadth first search next depth first search if you are considering in the sense it will go deeper and deeper this level it will visit first and then only it will go to the next level so first consider the starting vertex a and visit that vertex so from this vertex consider the next level unvisited vertices 2 3 and 4 from these three vertices break the tie using alphabetical order or number order so 2 is the next vertex will be visited so from 2 what is the next level unvisited vertices so from 2 5 1 6 among these two break the tie that is 5 so visit 5 first next from 5 what is the next level vertices 9 and 10 break the tie visit vertex 9 so now this level we have completed so from 9 there is no other deeper node okay so go back to 5 and what is the next unvisited vertex that is 10 now from 10 there is no deeper node then go back to 5 from 5 all the nodes are visited no unvisited vertex from 5 again go back to 2 from 2 5 1 6 5 is already visited next you visit 6 from 6 there is no deeper node go back to 2 from 2 all other vertices are visited so go back to 1 and from 1 2 is already visited now visit 3 and from 3 there is no deeper node so go back to 1 and from 1 visit the next level vertex unvisited vertex that is 4 and from 4 visit the next level unvisited vertices that is 7 and 8 break the tie 7 should be visited first from 7 visit the next level unvisited vertices 11 and 12 break the tie 11 should be visited and from 11 there is no deeper node go back to 7 so from 7 unvisited vertex is 12 visit 12 and from 12 there is no deeper node go back to 7 and from 7 there is no unvisited vertices okay there is no other unvisited vertices so go back to 4 from 4 the next level unvisited vertex is 8 visit 8 and then go back to from 8 there is no deeper node if there is any deeper node you have to go here okay so from 8 there is no deeper node go back to 4 now from 4 there is no unvisited vertices go back to 1 from 1 there is no unvisited vertex so now the algorithm completes so this is the bfs and dfs order for this given graph thank you for watching this video 